What up, girl? It's Mena. We are just... Ooh! I'm so done. <laughs> I just took off my head tag, so I laid my edges. I can't do it. Anyway, what up? It's your girl, Mena. In this video, we are going to be doing a sort of relaxing try test of the KVD Good Apple Skin Perfecting Foundation Balm. This is old. Like, it was a hype months ago. I do recognize that, but I did want to do the video. I just, when I look at that time, could not find my shade. It was sold out, and it was sent to me in PR, and I just said, why not? You want to see what it looks like on me? And also, I'm going to do an another look with this Huda Beauty Rose Quartz. I did an my first look with this when I first tried it out on a different video. So I'll link that video below. Make sure you watch that. I'm gonna do another look with this today because it's such a beautiful palette. So make sure you're subscribed. Also make sure you follow me on Instagram. Join my text community because it's free and you should be a part of it because why not? Also get ready for Vlogmas. I am planning that. I think it's gonna be really fun. So make sure you tune around for that and pray for your girl because it's my first time and it's already a lot. Even just the thought of it is a lot, okay? Silk Press is still hanging hanging on tight. I just laid her back today and here we go. I already primed my lips with the e.l.f. Cosmetics Lock On Lip Primer. I'm gonna link everything that I use below, okay? Even this robe, it is so comfy, honey. I've been wearing this robe for the past three days and I look at me, I'm like, oh, I love this robe so much. Wow, it is not too thick, not too light. It's just perfect, at least for Houston. I don't know if you live in a cold area, you might not think it's thick enough, but I love it. Of course you can wear stuff underneath it, I usually don't. So we gonna do this. Let's open it up. Now I did want to just refresh my mind on what this is, like what the benefits are. So it's a good apple skin perfect and hydrating foundation balm. First, have you ever used this? If so, what shade do you use and do you like it? All right. It's full coverage, matte finish, vegan, long wearing, good for dark circles, fine lines, and wrinkles, buildable, full coverage. Here we have the color Deep 80. It obviously looks light because of my lighting. What I can say though, is it definitely looks cool, red undertone, okay? And it goes up to Deep 98. There are nine shades above this actual shade, but I think they might've gotten it right. It's warm, excuse me, it's cool. So we are gonna have to finagle it with the concealer and stuff and we'll do all of that, okay? So um, I'm not gonna prime my face because I've been feeling a little dry. I did shave my face yesterday and I love how it looks. It is feeling hydrated. I'm gonna just leave it at that, okay? Now this is a bomb. It reminds me of the full coverage foundation. I'm not sure if it still exists from MAC when I used to work there, I had the full coverage foundation. It is so good. I actually wanna do a nostalgic full face of MAC, full face of all of my old favorites from MAC. I I really want to do that. Comment below and let me know if you would love to see that kind of a video. I would love to go into MAC again. I haven't been there in years. And just pick out all my old faves, girl, and give y'all a good video. It'd be so fun. All right, I'm going to use my sponge from Amazon. I'll link these below. Five pack for $8. And I've already dampened it, squeezed out all the water. Obviously, you saw nothing come out. It's damp, it's soaked through and through, but then I watched the sponge video, okay? But then, you know what? One last time for good measure. Just want to really make sure that it's not too wet, all right? And then, because this is a bomb. Ooh. Oh my God. Okay, so I took out too much. Oh my God. Wow. So I was ex I assumed that this was going to be more hard, more solid, like the MAC one. And when I went in here, I did way too much. Wowzers. Okay, I just oh righty. I just kind of messed this up. Wow. Okay, well, I got a lot of products. Let's just use what is right here. <gasps> Whoa. Oh. Oh my God. Oh, it is thick. It's rich. Wow, I took out too much. I'm so annoyed. If you've used the MAC one, comment and let me know. It is, it's, it's, it's more solid. So I, I did not know. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. This is very full coverage. It is obviously very cool. And you know, I do have some cool foundations that I've made work. I, let me see. Okay. They have 82. Oh, deep 80 is, is for deep skin with warm bronze undertones. Whereas deep 82 is for, is for deep skin with cool neutral undertones. I would love to get 82. This is full coverage. Ah, oh, I wonder if I should buy this now with this for sale. Wow. I mean, this is pretty, ugh. It's looking real red for me, girl. Dang it. Okay, I'm wiping off the excess because wowzers, I took far too much. Wiping off the excess to now just blend in what I got. Wow, I am loving how full coverage this is. What? 
Oh my God. The undertone is making me insane right now. Like why is the undertone that's making me insane? But I like this. I need to get another color. I can't do it. All right, let's see what's going on. Yo, this coverage is insane, man. Oh my God, what is going on? Look at my face. Jesus, lamb. I do not recall. <laughs> the coverage is out of this world. I wonder if I should go to Sephora. I'm not gonna have time, I'm gonna order it. I'm gonna order it today from Sephora. I'm gonna get a different shade, something neutral, because if this were neutral, wow, it would be out of this world, you know? But right now it's out of this world, but like in a different direction. The world is going in a different direction you know okay don't fret my pet i'm sure that we are going to make this work so let's work on that oh this is so creamy wow man i'm just trying to fix it because i just hate how i made a mess in here i hate that oh. all right oh my god let me use this catrice beauty <laughs> or catrice true skin high cover concealer i've used this in a testing new products video my fingers are all dirty this is the color what is the color this is the color 092 warm spices all right let me see if this is going to want this yes give me some yellow please some neutral ish something to fix this up wow just to balance this out a little bit this is a hydrating concealer full coverage but if you saw the video where i first tried it it wasn't full coverage for me honey it's given more medium to full but if you don't have blemishes on your face or if your blemishes aren't very dark you might use this and say mm, it's giving me full so for me i find that the concealer coverages are really personal My God, my God. All right, let's bring a little contour, some neutrality to this face with my Old Faithful Fenty Cream Bronze on the color Twoffy Tees because, wow. <laughs> but, you know, with the face powder, we're gonna go with, coat. I have this Kosas Cloud Set Velvety, you'll see. I'll do that and that will give it some more deepness. It'll darken up the face, which is what I need right now. Is that, I gotta blend that out. And then it'll also neutralize a little bit because wowzers like it looks like i'm wearing a mask <laughs> man this coverage is insane i gotta say i love it i gotta say that i love it i'm just I'm gonna have to figure out a different shade and i was into for the day god i should it wasn't on my mind it just wasn't on my radar at all it was a thing it was popular and i was looking for it i couldn't find it and i just figured out all about it and now here i am wishing i was wishing i had looked at the shades in store when i was there all right, now down the nose, taking leftover product so that we're not using too much product on the nose to contour. This contour is gonna look a lot darker because my face is light with this shade of the Apple Bomb. Wow, there's that. We gonna set this, let's see, what do I have for setting powder? Let me just use my Fenty Pro Filter you know what I'm saying? That situation in the color honey. I'm going to go ahead and use that. And then I'm going to, I'm going to use this cool toned bronzer from LYS Beauty in the color. It's No Limits Bronzer and the color is Worthy Deep because I need to bring some coolness up in here. All right, so we're bringing this in a little bit. Now I'm gonna use the Kosas, like I was telling you, Kosas Cloud, Cloud Set Powder, and the color is velvety, right? It's cool, and it's, I'm hoping it's gonna tone down. I'm not hoping, I know it will. It'll tone down the warmth that I have going on around here.
Right now I'm using the color Mantra in the crease for this eye look. All right, so what we think about the look, cause if you ask me, I'm loving it. It's reminding me of the Benefit Stick Foundation that I, Air Stick Foundation that I tried out in a different Testing New Products video. It's giving me that vibe. It's not as cool as I would like for my face to be, but it works. I don't always wanna have to make something work. So we did make it work for the video. You know what I normally do? You know what we do together, okay? But am I gonna wear this all the time? Absolutely not. The color I'm gonna just have to pass on down on, I don't know, I mean, I already like, <laughs> When I smudged it, wow, I'm so upset. I hate that that happened. Although I did smudge it in there one time, so it's not contaminated. I'll see, I'll have to pass it on to somebody, girl. But let me know how you feel in this look. Look at the eye too, baby. Baby, 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 baby. Ow, loving it. Earrings on Amazon, I'll link them below for the kid. I want you to let me know how much you love or like this look. Comment below, you never know, you might win a giveaway. Also make sure you're subscribed because if you didn't do it beforehand, you better do it now because the look is looking, okay? And as always, I'm glad you're here. Thank you for watching my video and I'll see you in another one. Bye.